In this video, we'll cover how to get started with creating a project in Rapid and the various project types that you can choose from. Once you click the plus button next to projects, you'll be prompted to fill out some basic info. Give your project a name, then select the project type. Use general image annotation for 2D image workflows. This project type supports geometry-based labels with the option to specify custom attributes or metadata for each label. These geometry annotations include bounding boxes, polygons, lines, points, and cuboids, which are all annotated with unique IDs. Use 2D semantic segmentation for pixel-wise annotation, which is useful to classify both the things of the world, like discrete objects, and the stuff, which we can think of as amorphous regions, such as the sky and the ground. We support both partial and full semantic segmentation, as well as unique instance masks for panoptic segmentation. Use text collection and categorization as a generalized project type to support various content and language tasks. These can include audio transcription, categorization, information collection and extraction, sentiment analysis, and more. There's also the option to specify consensus if you'd like multiple responses per task. Use document transcription to extract key fields from your documents. The output includes a bounding box for each field along with a text transcription. We can also support named semantic relationships between fields like invoice amount to the amount listed. Use named entity recognition to tag entities found in text using specific labels. For example, we could set up a task to label any mention of time or duration in a set of text. This project type also supports name semantic relationships between entities. Use video playback annotation for geometry-based object tracking and event tagging. Use bounding boxes, polygons, lines, points, and cuboids to track objects and people frame to frame with unique and consistent object IDs. Create named events that are tied to specific frames and optionally add verbal or written descriptions for each event. Finally, use LiDAR annotation to ingest your sensor fuse data from LiDARs, cameras, and radars to be annotated with 3D cuboids in Scales platform. While autonomous driving sequences is a primary use case we support, Scales Platform can also ingest 3D point cloud reconstructions to support a wide range of 3D annotation projects across many verticals, such as sidewalk robotics, drone delivery, AR, VR, and more. If there's a task type you'd like support for but don't see listed here, feel free to reach out to us on Scales website.